Hi, I'm Howard, I'm Howard Lux. This is your Orthopedic Minute. Do you know how many normal MRIs I see? How many normal interpretations from a radiologist? I'd like to say zero. It's probably not zero, but it's awfully close. Do you know what that means? When we age, things change. That includes our tissues. Our blue genes wear out. Why shouldn't our tendons wear out? What you need to understand and what's critical is that not all abnormalities seen on an MRI are truly abnormal. If you twist your knee and for some reason are sent for an immediate MRI and they find a cartilage tear, a meniscus tear, was that there before you twisted your knee? It's quite possible. What about you bend over and had back pain? You get an MRI the next day and you see a bulging disc. It's likely that was there too. It turns out that a lot of these abnormal findings are found in normal subjects without any pain. What that means is that you have to beware. There are many physicians who are taught to think mechanically that if something is broken, they must fix it. And therefore, if you land in that physician's office, if you may be indicated for a repair of a structure that wasn't bothering you and is not going to create any problems for you. Now, what we need to understand as physicians is that we have to put things in context. If you have certain complaints, and they are significant, and the MRI findings match, and your quality of life is limited, and you want to proceed further along the treatment, uh, tr treatment algorithm that your physician outlined, great. If you are having pain and it's not too significant and an MRI shows something, then in all likelihood, nothing needs to be done. Remember, as we age, things change. Not all abnormalities seen on an MRI are actually abnormal. Have a great day.